What's up everybody? Dan the Man in the house. I want to welcome you back to Dan the Man's Weekly. Today was Monday, December 18th, 2017. I would just enter Tuesday, December 19th, 2017. Yeah, uh, don't mind. It's very cold outside and I thought the light porch was on. But, <laughs> And bear with me on this one, and um, yeah, that's a long story. Okay, well, we've got, since we're less than a week away, now we're six days away till fa la 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 la. And we're down to our 12 final days of 2017, which means we are exactly 13 days away until 2018. So, who's ready? New Year. And just to let you know, we uh, the Best of 2017 slideshow will be up and running after Christmas. So it could be a two-parter, maybe a three-parter, but I'll keep you guys posted on that. So. Alright, well, since it's fun to talk about, let's go ahead and then switch gears now. On to the recap for the seventh birthday tribute to Adriana Lopez, also known as Adi Luna. Yep, and I just wanted to say that um, it was so nice uh, making a, yet another birthday tribute. And you know, she's a, a poet, singer, actress, a semi-regular of the b and, um And I just want to say, uh, I hope she enjoyed that birthday tribute I did for Adriana. And just like the previous six I did, uh, you know the previous six. Yeah, before Adriana last Friday, so. But I just want to say, um, Adriana, I hope you enjoyed that birthday tribute that I did for you, and I hope you enjoyed it. If you guys have missed out on the birthday tribute for Adriana Lopez, also known as Adi Luna, I'll leave the link right down there. Please check it out. And if you guys want the previous six, um, I'll go ahead and leave the link right down there, okay? So, yeah, go ahead and check it out. And speaking of birthday tributes, just to let you know, we have two more birthday tributes. We have an eighth and the ninth birthday tribute has both have been confirmed. So there'll be two more birthday tributes, the eighth and the ninth. Again, a surprise. I'll keep you guys posted. All right, you guys, let's go ahead and switch gears now. On to the Cowboys. Yep. How about them Cowboys? Yeah, it was a close call at the end, so yep, they had successfully defeated Oakland Raiders. So, there's a chance we could hit the playoffs, but this coming Christmas Eve on Sunday, they're up against Seattle Seahawks, and Ezekiel Elliott is coming back. So, let's hope we pick up the wind, and if we do, there might be a chance that we can hit the playoffs. But we'll have to go through the Philadelphia Eagles on next Sunday, New Year's Eve. So here goes nothing. So if we win, we'll be 10 and 6, and we will we'll have a chance to get to the playoffs. So we need we need those wins. So for all you Cowboys fans out there, let's give our best root and support for the Cowboys and you Cowboys out there. And Zeke, welcome back. So, I hope you learned your lesson. And as for Dak Prescott, Jason Witten, B, uh, Wayne Beersley, among others, let's pick up those wins and let's get to the playoffs, okay? And as always, go Cowboys. All right, switching gears now. On to the recap from the La Voice Mexico from last Sunday. Yeah, a big congratulations to Luis Adrian. Um, yep, yeah, he is the winner of the of La Voice Mexico with Team Lara Pausini. <laughs> so, yeah, this is the first win for uh, Lara Pausini. And big congr and felicidades to Luis Adrian. And, yeah, unbelievable. Brian G didn't make the final cut. And I just wanted to say that, um, Ryan, you did the best you could, and I'm proud of you. You've gotten this far, man. You were close to the finals, man. So, I just want to say, you did a great job, and we're proud of you. And we're all proud of you, my friend. Okay? So, my two thumbs up to you. 
Okay. And I wish Ali Esparza would have made the finals as well. And I had a dream that Ali Esparza won the Love Voice Mexico. So, <laughs> so Elia, my shout outs to you. Okay. And again, Elia, I'm proud of you. Sorry, I gotta move it inside. Too darn cold. <laughs> Alright, All right, let's. Where was I? Okay, switching gears now uh, to the City Magazine. As you already know, about a week ago, the, the winners have already been announced. So, therefore, um, if you guys want to check out the winners, uh, go to the City Magazine at ELP.com. Uh, the, list of, the list of winners of this year's Best of 2017 is right there. Please check it out. And you guys want to save the date in three and a half weeks from Saturday, the Best of 2017 City Magazine event. It's Saturday, January 13th at the Southwest University Event Center at the East Side. So looking forward for that. So just save the date. And tickets are going to be on sale. So uh, buy your tickets if you plan to attend there. Okay, let's go ahead and switch gears now. Uh, to miscellaneous news, as you already heard, the and AOL Instant Messenger has now come to a close after 20 years. Man, man, that was fun using AOL Instant Messenger. <laughs> that was like a long, long, long time ago. <laughs> and I'll never forget that wonderful memories. <laughs> Alright, switching gears now. Okay, brace yourselves. Better get right to... Yep, very bad news. As you already heard last Thursday, the FCC has voted to stop net neutrality, which means we are in grave danger. But it looks like the, the fight to those who oppose it is not backing down. And there are several states, and among others, including a couple of Congress, they are planning to sue the FCC. Even though it looks like net neutrality, the fate of it is still unknown. But we don't know if the vote's going to be still on or we'll have those who oppose it, especially those who gave the Senate and the Congress a wake-up call. It looks like they might be a chance to turn the tide against the vote. So, And again, like I said, they just vote. It looks like we won't be backing down until the internet the internet is saved, if you know what I mean. And that's what they're claiming. We're not shutting the internet down. Uh, we're only stopping net neutrality, which they have no idea what that means. Well, they'll keep you guys posted on the net neutrality, the fate by the FCC, so we'll have to wait and see. Anybody heard last, uh, just yesterday morning, an Amtrak train outside of Tacoma uh, had derailed onto the Interstate 5. And, oh man. And sadly, so far, six lives were lost. So, um, my thoughts and prayers goes out to the, to the people affected by it. Oh, unbelievable. And you won't believe this, there was a powder outage and it was all lights out. It was some sort of a blackout at the Hartfield Atlanta International Airport and some somewhat 300 commuters were, were stuck there and they have no idea what was going on. Man, why a blackout at an international airport? Unbelievable. <laughs> Alright, now this has been... Yep, very bad news. Alright, all right, switching gears now. On a sadder note, five years ago, Sandy Hook had became a tragedy. 26 lives were lost at that time, and we'll never forget this fateful day. And it has been 20 years since the legendary Chris Farley has passed away. You might know him as the Chippendale with the late um, Patrick Swayze back in the 1990s. <laughs> it, it was nice. And he was the lunch lady where um, Adam Sandler sang that skit. And he was Matt Foley. <laughs> 
Man, I like this guy. I know he's been on a couple of films including Airheads and Black Sheep, uh, Tommy Boy, and his last film was Almost Heroes. And man, outstanding comedian and actor. But rest in peace, Chris Farley. Okay, let's go ahead and wrap this up. I want a big shout out to those who send in their video birthday shout outs to Adi Luna, oh, Adriana Lopez from last Friday, which I managed to edit that in. Um, thank you so much for the video birthday shout outs to Adriana, well, Adi, okay, this is thoughtful of you guys. Thank you so much. A uh, big shout out to Austin Freeman and his wife Jenna. Uh, Austin, great night, great performance at the Texas Stagecoach Saloon. Uh, and Jenna, good to see you. My best to Ad little Adeline. A big shout out to Will Heron. Um, congrats, grad. Amber Yamato, congrats, grad. And Bree Thomas, UTEP soccer number two, congrats, grad. Um, reason why I said congrats, grad, because they just graduated last Saturday from UTEP. So, congratulations to the graduates. And go Miners. A uh, big shout out to Ryan G. Hey Ryan, I'm proud of you, my friend. You did your best. You know, you came this far. Also, shout outs to Richie of the Barbed Wire Open Mic Series, Anthony Austin Brown, Otis Hicks, Stony Iron, Roberto Sebuveda, Lira Morale. Ice, Julian, Kiss the Poet, Chauncey Lowe, among others. A big congrats to my old friend Lala Ferris, and she just tied the knot to her longtime boyfriend Jamie. I did not get the last name, sorry. So, Lala, Jamie, big congrats, best wishes. And a big congrats to Tuesday Lopez and Christopher Mitchell. They just had their baby boy, Kaimani. So, Tuesday, Christopher, big congrats, Mom and Dad. All right, let's get to birthdays. Uh, birthdays from last Friday. Adriana Lopez, also known as Adi Luna. Hey, Adriana, or Adi, I hope you enjoyed that birthday tribute I did for you last Friday. I hope you enjoy it. Again, happy birthday. And for those of you who missed out on the birthday tribute to Adi Luna, uh, the link's right down there. Please check it out. Okay, birthdays earlier today. Jocelyn Wilson. Hey, Jocelyn, happy birthday. My best to Ian. James Allen Bunt Jr. Um, James, long time. Happy birthday. Daniel Harris. Hey, Daniel, happy birthday. Tell Josie I said hello. My best to your kids. Ashley Thomas. Ashley, happy birthday. My best to your family. Scott Emerson, Alex Stiles, and Chase Osborne. Happy birthday. Birthdays later today. Meredith Nauman. Meredith, long time, my friend. Happy birthday. Jet Shavoni of Gleewood. Hey Jet, happy birthday. Tell Callie I said hello. Hey, Juju Aguirre. Hey Juju, happy birthday. And yes, I got you good. <laughs> Stephanie Winkle uh, and Stacy Buddington, happy birthday. Best to your families. Okay. All right, birthdays tomorrow. Mary Beth Ellis Roberts. Hey, Mary Beth, happy birthday. Tell Drift and I say hello. My best to Blake. 
Bobby Pippin. Hey, Bobby. Long time. Happy birthday. Tell Brandy I said hello. D Lane Brisco. D. Long time. Happy birthday. Tell Philip I said hello. Bye, best to Ethan. Crystal Medina, Susan Peters, and Catherine Marie Martinez. Happy birthday. Birthday's Thursday. Sam Tribble. Hey, Sam. Long time. Happy birthday. Mark Malenko Northrup, uh, also known as Sting Jr. <laughs> hey, Mark. Long time, my friend. Happy birthday. Andre Axtry. Yeah, Andre, long time. Happy birthday. Aldo Aguirre, Daisy Aguirre, and Veronica Young. Happy birthday. Birthday's Friday, Brittany Temple. Brittany, happy birthday. Miguel Ayala and Jesse Whitaker. Happy birthday. Birthday Saturday, Marissa C. Marissa, happy birthday. And Ted Stevenson, happy birthday. Birthday Sunday, Christmas Eve. Fabiola Reyes Hessian, Fabiola, long time. Happy birthday. Dante Jamal White, Dante, happy birthday. Best of the family. Fernando Rivera, Amy Duchesne, Arlene Hart, and August and Ventura, happy birthday. All in August. Um, tell Amber I said hello and congrats, Grad. <laughs> Alright, birthday's Monday, Christmas Day. Jacqueline Thornton. Hey, Jacqueline, happy birthday. Best of the family. Tell Jennifer and Rhonda I said hello. Uh, Lucas Finney. Lucas, happy birthday. Long time. And Alfredo Campos, happy birthday. And birthday's next Tuesday. Aaron Renee Barraza. Aaron, long time. Happy birthday. And tell Tony I said hello. Beth Leeser, Jeanette Dominguez, Mary Ellen Wheatley, Erica Finkel, Lauren Steneca Lopez, J. Cal Alber, Jessica Vasquez, and Kitty Can. Happy birthday. Alright, and that's all the birthdays for right now. Okay, guys. Well, like I said, we got less than a week and six days till. La 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 la. I hope you guys better finish up your Christmas cards because Christmas is closing in and better finish up your shopping. Yep. And are you naughty or nice? <laughs> uh, if you know what I mean. <laughs> okay. Alright, and that's it for me. Well, I gotta get a head start on the slideshow. So, y'all have a great rest of the week. I will see you on Sunday for Christmas Eve. Or, you know, and just before Santa takes off. <laughs> Y'all know what to do. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Message me. Like my page on Facebook. Be sure to subscribe me on YouTube. Hashtag Dan the Man's Weekly. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Until then, this is Dan the Man Tennessee. Signing out.